Hi, in this video we're going to show you how you can remove the dash file explorer suffix from your open file explorer tabs on your taskbar in Windows. So as you can see here, I have three separate file explorer windows open and they all have dash file explorer on them and they're all taking up extra space on the taskbar. So of course this is only going to apply if you use the specific setting here, which I'll show you. Right down here, if you have the combined taskbar buttons and hide labels set to never, if you change it to always, then it's not going to matter. So it's only when you have never or when taskbar is full applied there. All right, so to do so, we're going to be using the free Windhawk app. Let me open this up here. So this works by installing mods on your computer, and then these specific mods kind of tweak the settings or customize Windows to make these kind of uh, features work. All right, so when you install it, you'll have your home screen, which will have any mods you have installed and your featured mods. And then you have the Explore section where you can search for them and also kind of browse some of the featured mods, and then you can sort them as well. So the one we're going to be using is called Remove File Explorer Suffixes. We already have it installed. So once you find it in the search area here, you just click on Details and Install. But I already have it installed. So let me go into it here. And right now it's disabled, so I'm going to enable it. And this one does not have any settings. Most mods will, but this one doesn't because it's just a simple one. All right, so now I'm going to have to close these to have it take effect here. All right, so now you can see it just says Home. It doesn't say Dash File Explorer afterwards. Let's open up Documents. Same thing there. So it gives you a little more space on your taskbar and gets rid of that redundant dash file explorer label at the end. And then if you change your mind, you can either come here and disable it or remove it completely from Windhoc. And one note I'll make here is that Windhoc needs to be running for these mods to stay working. So it has to be down in your system tray. So it should set itself to start with Windows automatically when you install it. But if for some reason your mods stop working, just come and make sure it's running. And if not, just simply restart Windhawk and it should take care of that. All right, so let's disable this real quick. Close these off again. And now you can see we have our Dash File Explorer back. All right, so I will put a link in the description where you can download the free Windhawk app. And then you just want to do a search for Remove File Explorer Suffixes on the Explore section right there. Install it, enable it, and that's all you need to do. Alright, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.